Hello guys, I welcome you all on this wonderful platform that is Resultant. So guys, you are aware that HPCL have given the notification two days back. So definitely it is a very good opportunity for mechanical engineering students as more than 90 plus posts are there. And this is a huge vacancy last year, only 57 vacancies were there. So definitely you guys would be making the plan to prepare for this. So guys, those who are preparing the plan, obviously they would be looking for the previous year's paper that what are the highest weighted subject, what is the cutoff and what is the pattern of exam. So guys, with uh, this session, I will be telling you about weightage analysis and also the cutoff of last year. Okay. So guys, first of all, uh, when we are going to start this all, uh, let us see. Uh, this is the uh, detail about me. I feel uh, many times you are watching me, so you would be aware of that I'm having around 13 plus years of experience. Name is Dira Sadhana. These are the areas which I'm going to take, uh, the interested subject. And guys, uh, this is my telegram channel, Mechanical by Dira Sardana. You can join to get the PDF of all the important session and also all the things. So guys, first of all, the exam pattern I'm telling you, total 170 question in 150 minutes with this marking scheme out of which 85 are going to be technical and I will be telling you out of this 85 how many questions are from SOM, how many questions are from production which will give you an idea that what are the subjects which are high scoring subject which are high weightage subject okay so that you can concentrate more on that okay so let us move so guys if you talk about this and you would also be uh, looking for the cutoff for last year for mechanical 57 seats were there and for 57 seats, cutoff was 103.64 for general category, 102 for EWS, 101 for OBC, 92 for SC. So by looking at this cutoff, obviously when the seats are more than 90 plus, so dear, obviously if seats are 90 plus, I would be saying that cutoff should go down to around 90, 95 like that. Okay. So definitely if cutoff is coming down. Uh, it is going to be advantageous for you. So you can have a target like that. Okay. So for that, I am going to tell you the suspense is over now that what are the subjects which were asked for more number of marks in the HPCL paper. So I am telling you the uh, weightage analysis of last three years, not only one year. So I am telling you the weightage analysis of last three years. So that will give you an idea. Is there a trend or they are just arbitrarily asking anything? So, dear, first we will see about thermal sizes. In 2021, 13 questions. In 2022, uh, they have asked 10 questions. And in 2023, 8 questions. So, you may be thinking that weightage is shrinking. Okay. So, but I would like to say the reason for this shrink is something different. Because in 2023, some extra syllabus of ESC paper 1, hai na? some basic subjects of civil engineering and elect electrical machines are added. So that weightage of 21 questions that was covered by these kind of reductions. So thermal sizes, if I will tell you overall, if you see the weightage, so I would like to say you can expect for this year, it will be there somewhere between 8 to 10 marks. Okay. So this I am telling you the expectation for the 24 paper. Then for HMT, here it was four questions, here it was nine questions, then it is five question. HMT is a small subject. I will say five to six question you can expect for uh, HPCL 2024. For fluid mechanics, if you see 13 questions were there uh, in the 2021, then it reduced to 11, then it reduced to six. I will say you can expect somewhere around six to eight. Okay. And similarly, when we talk about machine design, it was four there, then seven, then four. I will say you can expect 4 to 5. Okay. Then my dear industrial engineering. It was 2 in 2021, then 6, then 6. It is also a good subject. We can expect the same 5 to 6 questions similar to HMT. If you see production, production is always higher weightage. Here it was 21, here it was 14, here it was 16. I will say you can expect somewhere around 15 to 18 questions from this topic. Okay. Even in some good side, it can go up to 20 as well. Now, my dear, extra syllabus, whenever we are talking about, if it is going to be there this year also, which ideally should be, because generally they follow the previous year trend only, if that syllabus will be there, then you can expect approximately uh, 15 to 18 uh, questions or up to 20 questions from that area. But if that will not be there, then these 20 questions will be distributed to all the subjects 
and definitely you can expect an increase of two to three question in all the subjects uh, and definitely the major advantage will be going to production for that again so like production previously was having 21 if that syllabus is going to be removed then in these 21 at least five questions will be going to production and this production is also including material size even i will tell you if i am saying 16 now out of this 10 questions 8 to 10 questions are from material size rest 8 questions will be from other parts of production so material size is more important for hbcl exam then my dear we are coming to the other subjects like engineering mechanics it was 11 in 21 then it became 5 then it became 4 i will say you can expect 5 to 6 somewhere for strength of material it was 10 then it come to 7 then it come to 7 so i will suggest it may go up to 8 to 10 it should increase because SOM is a fundamental subject and when we talk about theory of machines and vibration it was 7 then 16 then 8 so here major questions were there from vibrations very few questions were there from theory of machines so here also I will be expecting guys somewhere 8 to 10 uh, should be there okay 8 to 10 should be there and my expectations are including the extra syllabus if extra syllabus is not going to be there then definitely these things will be changing now, if you don't have the HPCL syllabus, if you don't have the previous year paper, download resultant mechanical app. There you will be getting in free study material. There is a specific folder of HPCL. There we are, we have added the syllabus of last year also. And we have also added the previous year paper and you will get a lot of content will be provided there. So download the app and get the benefit and in within uh, next week you will also see some bigger announcement related to HPCL preparation. We are going to help you with YouTube session with some courses as well. So you can get the proper benefit and get selection in these 2-3 months whatever they are going to give you. So guys now we are going to talk about majorly important subjects. It is production, material size, fluid mechanics, thermal sizes, storm and vibration and strength of material. These are going to be higher weightage if you are not going to have what the extra syllabus extra syllabus includes what if you see the extra syllabus it is having the subjects of esc paper one what are those subjects like related to energy and environment major questions were there from energy and environment second subject from where questions were there is project management third why i will say material size actually this material size and this material size are having 70-80% same syllabus, technical part and ESC paper 1. So that is why here the weightage of material size was more. That is also one of the reasons. So fourth, whenever we are talking about, it is going to be related to what? It is going to be from ICT also two to three questions were there. Then current affair, okay. Although aptitude is already covered, so that was not the part. Mathematics was not the part uh, much if you see. And then questions were there from which other areas, if I tell you. Out of them, they were some from basic of civil engineering, okay, which you studied the first year. And some questions, two to three were there from electrical machine part also, like synchronous motor and all, okay, uh, synchronous machines and all. So, but not, uh, you can say from all these areas, one, two, one, two, one, two questions was there. But if you are talking about these areas, these areas are definitely, uh, you guys would be feeling difficulty because very vast syllabus is there. So I expect that this year they remove this syllabus. But if they don't remove, we need to choose some portion of this so that we can easily get the selection. Even if you leave this part, you can get the selection if your aptitude part is good because minimum cutoff required in technical is 50%. And obviously out of 80 marks, if you are going to, uh, out of uh, like 85, if you are going to get 50 very easily, then there is no problem. Okay, so if you do your technical part very nicely, then even with uh, uh, leaving the extra type of syllabus, you can definitely very easily crack this exam because number of seats are also more. Because of negative marking, obviously uh, cutoff is going to be like last year it was 103. So obviously cut off, I feel it should be uh, uh, getting more down by 5-10 marks because the number of seats are more, okay. So guys, uh, we have discussed this, you can just uh, join my telegram channel Mechanical by Dheeraj Sardana and also in the description you are having the WhatsApp channel link, uh, telegram channel link, uh, also you are going to have the resultant app link. So do 
download that join that and get the benefit of this so goodbye guys for this particular session and we are going to be there for all the things related to your preparation so just like the session share it and subscribe the channel goodbye guys for this particular video goodbye